Over at Old Dominion University, they're still buzzing about yesterday's dramatic win at Jacksonville. Monarch fans have been chopping at the bit to see how it happened. News Channel 3 was there in Jacksonville, and it's drama you'll see only on 3. What a day it was for the Old Dominion Monarchs. Their first road game in 69 years. Lots of fans on hand in Jacksonville, but the Dolphins got off to the fast start. A couple of Josh McGregor touchdown passes, and before you knew it, it was 13-0. But Mario Crawford got the Monarchs on the board. But guess what? Back came Jacksonville. They led 20-7 at the intermission. But in the second half, in the third quarter, the only team to score was Old Dominion. And then, when Mario Crawford goes 32 yards down to the two-yard line, you're thinking... Wow, maybe this can be the comeback of the season for Old Dominion. Remember, they've never trailed before in a game this year. Crawford finishes the drive. It's 27-21. They turn their eyes to the defense. And the defense comes up big, giving Old Dominion a shot. Final drive. They start at their own nine. 91 yards and a couple of key receptions by former Phoebus Phantom Reed Evans later. It set up the play of the year for Old Dominion. 32-yard line, DeMarco looking right, floating it down toward Jackson, caught by Jackson, touchdown, Old Dominion, Dorian Jackson from Thomas DeMarco, 32 yards, and guess what, we're tied at 27. After Drew Harris's point after touchdown gives the Monarchs a one-point lead, Jacksonville has a last chance, but the field goal is wide right, final score, Old Dominion 28, Jacksonville 27, fans going nuts, players going nuts, afterwards we spoke to them. But the first one, he uh, it was a little too long, but he threw it again, and I was like, I gotta get this one. And the man was beat, I beat him a little bit, so I figured I just gotta catch it and hold on to it. And that was it. And there was no denying you getting in that end zone, was there? Nah, I had to reach, I was reaching for it, I had to reach for it. I had that feeling that we were just gonna get it done. You know, uh, took the plays, made my progression, or read, read my progression, uh, came out, gave the ball to the playmakers, and it, we just moved down the field smoothly. And that last play to Dorian. It felt great. I mean, uh, I missed him on the a previous play. Uh, came back at it. You know, they went man coverage. He uh, he beat his guy, and I put the ball there. Minute and a half to go, 91 yards. I mean, it's not the ideal place to start a drive, is it? Oh, it's the best place in the world to start a drive. <laughs> if you're a quarterback, that's the situation you want to be in. Um, we knew in that situation that uh, that we were going to have to be poised, but we, we had timeouts and we had time. You know, we had plenty of time. We actually gave the ball back to them with about 40 seconds left. This was just incredible, and I'm just so proud of our kids.